Hello and welcome to another video of this machine learning do it yourself series. In this video we are going to talk about decision tree and specifically on C5.0 classification. So as we have discussed earlier in the other videos for regression decision trees are also very powerful classifiers. These utilize because a tree structure it's more of a flow chart and it's really strong in terms of classifications as well. It's an all-purpose classifier which is C.0 C is an all-purpose classifier which has a highly automatic learning process. It can handle both numeric or non-numeric features. It uses entropy which is analogous to information theory that quantifies the randomness or disorder within a set of class values. The syntax for C.5.0 C is this C model, the keyword C5.0 which is in blue, train predictors, the predictors which are going to be used for training and train target for training purposes. And then this is predict again here, predict is the keyword which is going to predict the test using the model trained here. So we're going to see the hands-on in a few minutes. So to do this, we're going to use the same balance scale data set which we have used in the previous video on the KNN algorithm. So class name, left weight, distance, right weight and right distance. Uh, this is the data set location and this is the citation policy for that data set. So I'm making sure that I am following the policy. Now last time we had the data set and I changed the class from a numeric to 1, 2, 3 which is a non-numeric sorry uh, from non-numeric BRL to numeric 1, 2, 3 but I'm going to keep this time class as B for balance, R for right, and L for left balance. I have saved this version as balance scale copy, and this is also available in the Google Drive link, which looks something like this. And this link is available in the description section of the video, and here you go. So this is your R script, and this is the CSV file for this video. So coming back to our studio, I'm going to use the same kind of format as we did for KNN algorithm. So the same set of 625 values with five variables. And if you do the summary, this is the classification left weight, left distance, right weight and right distance. Next is we will do the train and test data set exactly similar to what we did for K and N. So this is just to make sure that we have good mix of the last few variables. And then please note that the last time we did 600 now we are doing 550 just for better test. We are putting more number of records in the test data frame. So you can see now it's 550 and 75 and then you have to require C, you need, you need C50 package. If you don't have the package, please install this package using install.packages C50. So I'm gonna say require. So in the next video, we are gonna do the classification on decision tree C5.0 and we see how to improve the model as well. Thank you for watching.